Welcome students to Moon Technology. Today we are introducing the bandsaw and the safety on the bandsaw and how to make a relief cut. Now the most important part about the bandsaw is obviously safety. Safety first. Anytime you're in one of my labs, make sure you have your safety glasses on. Now there are also several other things you need to worry about uh, dealing with the bandsaw is uh, always keep your fingers in tight. Now the important part is that you don't want to get your fingers anywhere close to the actual bandsaw, actual near the blade. Now the reason why we call it a bandsaw is because it has one continuous blade that goes in a circular motion around two wheels. Now also, dealing with the bandsaw, never have anyone stand to the right. Dealing with the blade going this way in a circular motion, if that blade were to snap, you don't want it hitting the table and shooting off to the other side and possibly hurting someone. Now another thing you need to deal with with the bandsaw is you have to set your guide. Now this right here is your adjustment pulley or your adjustment knob for the guide. Always adjust this when the machine is off. You have to set your guide roughly a quarter inch above your work. And you just tighten up that adjustment knob to hold the guide right in place. Now today, I have two different cuts for you today. We have a curved cut and we have a straight cut. Now the curved cut, I'm going to make several passes straight to my material. Now I've put X's on the material I want to cut away. I'm also going to be making a straight cut. Now I use the tri-square to make that straight cut as well. And I always use pencil. Okay, so safety glasses, no loose clothing is on, and hair is pulled back. Make sure everything is ready to go. Okay, before you are ready to turn on your machine, just gonna do a quick look around to make sure there isn't anything that you could step on and possibly fall over. Now again, hold your fingers in, tight like a squirrel, you know? Okay, so I've set everything, everything's ready to go. You're going to ask for me to come over, we're going to take a look at this, make sure I'm going to just double check everything, and then we'll be ready to go. So the first cut I'm going to make is the straight cut. Now please watch my fingers, watch how it doesn't get anywhere near the blade. So, take my material off the table, I'm going to ahead and push the start button. Now it does have some noise to it, so please just don't be scared. If you feel uncomfortable, have me come over and I'll be happy to make the cut for you. Okay, so I'm putting this down, I'm cutting on the left side, your right, of the, of the line. Because that's the material I'm cutting out. So I put this down on the table, my fingers are not anywhere near. Okay. Let the blade do the work, do not force your material. Do not force your material through the bandsaw. Let the blade cut it for you. Once I start getting close to the blade, I'm moving my left hand, and I'm just going to continue. Going straight through. Now this is a safe thing to do. It's absolutely fine. I can stick my hand right through here, because that is a safe zone, right through this area. I'm going to hold on to my other piece that I've just cut and finish my cut. Slide your material away from the machine, knock off the rest onto the floor, slowly pull back all material, and shut off the machine. As you can see, I've made a nice straight cut, and we can use a sander to get closer to my line. Okay. The second cut I'm going to do is the relief cuts. Now I can't just make this cut because you'll jam the blade. So therefore I need to make several cuts in so I can make that curve. Okay. So again, everything's all set, no materials in the way, hands are safe, safety glasses are on, no one's around me, no one's standing to the right. Okay. We're going to make our relief cuts. relief cuts, I'm just going straight into where my line is, and I'm slowly pulling back on the blade.
now these are your relief cuts. Now I'll be able to take the bandsaw and go straight to this cut and have room to play with so I can move my material around to make this cut. We'll start that up right now. So I'll get the fingers away from the material. I'm cutting on the outside of the line where my X is. Move one piece, and I can go on to my next one. how you cut out a curve. Again, what you're going to be using is a belt sander or any type of sander to get closer to your line. Always stay on the outside of the line. Tune in next week on Moon Technology and we'll set up a fence on the table or on the bandsaw to run several straight cuts. Have a good day.